It's Way Up with Angela Yee. I'm Angela Yee, and Jasmine from the Jasmine brand is here. I'm not just any brand. I'm, I'm my own, own brand. Mayno is here. New Mayno. New Mayno. And not let's the get old into one. this Yee T. Mm -hmm. Larsa Pippen is uh, going to get half of Scottie Pippen's retirement. Oh. Yes, man. according to new legal documents that was obtained by the blast, it was an order wow. put in place by an L.A. County court, and that is specifying her rights to his 401k and savings mm. plan mm -hmm. trust. Okay. So she is being recognized as Scottie Pippen's ex-wife. She is. Mm -hmm. He married her in 1997. The official date of separation is November 3rd, 2016. So she was legally awarded 50% of all account balances as of the plan's value amount closest to the date of their separation. Okay. If um, violation was a person. But that's California. It's normal. Angela, when she was on your show, you interviewed her. I recalled her saying how she kind of helped the household and she helped him with his business and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. it's not like she was just doing nothing all these so, years. And they have children oh, she was, together. I'm pretty sure she was doing a lot. Okay, Mayno. <laughs> I know right. such a hater. <laughs> well, I'm, not a, I'm not hating. And you know, sometimes people do sacrifice to raise the children and be home. That is a job in itself. Mm -hmm. And she didn't have a, her own personal career. She was kind of in his spotlight, so she deserves it. That. And that's the valuation for 2016. So if the I value believe, of that goes she had a lot of fun. goes up, she'll just get the valuation of half of that from mm -hmm. then. Mm -hmm. Okay. Stepped all over that man. All right, now fans are convinced that Travis Scott is dating SZA. Mm. <laughs> Mayno, you've been on it. Mayno loves man. him some SZA. Mm -hmm. So there is. Woo! What? Man, SZA <laughs> loves SZA. Mm. I know. Uh, and people are saying that they would make a great couple. You know, it makes sense. But some people are saying SZA and Travis, Travis are just friends, and there's no real. Proof. So he's not with his. Uh, Kylie no. Jenner. Kylie's dating someone else right now. Uh, Timothy Chalamet. Is that how you say his name? I don't know. Yeah, so <laughs> if you if you look at the Jasmine Brand's Instagram page, you can see the chemistry between. Oh, this is chemistry. You said this is chemistry. Let me this, see. No, I'm, you look on our end. The no, Jasmine Brand. Because you judge just by pictures. You don't even. I, care. We have footage on the Jasmine Brand's oh. Instagram, and you see the chemistry between Travis Scott and SZA. Really. And Mayno is so jealous because he I, loves SZA. Yeah. I like SZA. I think she's a dope artist, I and mean, I think she's very uh, attractive, bodacious. Bodacious. Yeah. I like that word. Mm -hmm. All right. NBA young boy is responding to the granddaughter of John Gotti after she had some words for him, uh, following her uh, brother's fight daddy. with Floyd Mayweather Jr. <laughs> Remember, she wrote Nicolette Gotti wrote Floyd Mayweather. Your daughter was ran through by an animal with twelve different baby mamas. Your little circus animal. You're all a pack of zoo animals. I swear, mm -hmm. my kids, mm -hmm. I'm coming for your daughter. It Maybe two years, three years from now, but I'm coming. I felt like that definitely had racist of course. undertones. All under, <laughs> Absolutely. Yes. Well, NBA young boy said nothing until last night in a video. Here's what he had to say. Got it, daughter. I'm going to tell you like this. I hope you do that the words away two, three years from now. I don't give a It ain't my business. I hate that And when it come to her daddy, that don't need to be in my mentions. I don't with him. Your brother lost the fight. I idolize your daddy. Man, next time you ever disrespect me, y'all gonna have to bomb me. Have a blessed day, beautiful. Have, I'm confused. Have a blessed day, beautiful. <laughs> I idolize your daddy. That's not the response I expected. Yeah, what you expected? It's not. I expect him to be like, don't be, you know, don't be coming for I me. Expect him to go for, go at her. Don't be coming right. at y'all. You're like, I, that's that's not what I would expect. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, not at all. What did he say? Have a have a blessed, blessed day, day, beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> all right, now Lotto has revealed that she is going to skip another round of body enhancing surgery, and instead she hired a personal trainer. She's on the cover of Cosmopolitan. Okay. And she talked about her body image. She said uh, surgery gives speedy results, but people still have to take care of their body. She got a BBL in 2020. Mm. She also got 360 lipo. That's her. Her stomach, backsides, and a whole torso, but you do have to maintain it. Ooh. You see what it looks like when people don't maintain it. Yeah. She also talked about keeping her boyfriend's identity private. Mm. She opened up about that and why staying off the grid is important to her. She said, if something is special to me, I'm going to keep it close to me because everything else has to be front and center about my life. And she does say that... Um, he does not consistently show up to surprise her, but, uh, you know, he what? does it regularly. It's not a consistent thing, but he does it regularly because he also values her privacy. 
Okay. So, you know, the more he shows up, the more people are like, oh, look who's here. Mm. But he will surprise her. Uh, she said, I think we find the beauty in separation because sometimes it makes us miss each other. My privacy is more important than seeing him in the crowd. I can't have people putting two and two together. This is the longest relationship I've been in. Mm. Okay? Yeah. Okay. And I just sent you, Jasmine, before this even came out, our article about how studies have shown that keeping that personal and private is actually better for your relationship and showing a person too much really shows that you need validation. Right. We're going to discuss that when we come back. Absolutely believe that. We know, Please, they know. Let's talk about okay. that. It's the way up at Angela Yee. Let's discuss when we come back.